the Oilers brought the game within one on two different occasions thanks to Ryan Nugent Hopkins who scored his second shorthanded marker of the preseason and Riley Shahan but it is the visiting Arizona Coyotes who skate out of Rogers Place on Tuesday night with a 4-2 victory securing their second win in as many games. Now after the game head coach Dave Tippett said he got significant contributions from his bottom six but the top six simply needs to be better. I mean, if you're, if you're going to make plays, make plays. We had far too many turnovers in both groups, right? So it, it allowed, you saw the bottom six, they, they trapped Arizona in their zone a number of times just through work. And the top six were having a hard time because we were turning over the puck all the time. Yeah, it's uh, obviously not the result we wanted. Um, I think there's a few lapses throughout the game, kind of segments that we took our foot off the gas and... Um, playing a little too casual so uh, we showed a lot of good things too though and um, a lot to work on a lot to be um, I don't want to say happy about but um, things that we learn in a positive way so uh, we just got to come back tomorrow and, and realize what we did wrong and fix it. Obviously we wanted to put a few more in but played well and they uh, they box out well in front and uh, I mean we got to find those second third chances right away. Um, I thought we did a pretty good job of getting pucks back and then putting more on, but um, maybe just to get those uh, quick ones uh, right away. But, uh, uh, yeah, I mean, like I said, take some positives and uh, move on from this one. We had a veteran lineup. They had a veteran lineup as well. So, um, it was a pretty close to an NHL game as, as you're going to get. So, um, you know, we did some good stuff. We did some we had some stuff that we need to work on. Um, you know, credit to them. They've always been a solid de defensive team, and, and uh, they found a way to, to kind of clog it up. And making his preseason debut, Mike Smith turned aside 15 of 17 shots in 40 minutes of action, while goaltender Miko Koskinen stopped 14 in just over 18 minutes. Another note to pass along your way, head coach Dave Tippett did say that Joel Pearson left the game with an upper body injury and will be re-evaluated on Wednesday morning. From Rogers Place, Tony Brar or the TV.